Lord. A story that personally has me very excited is that water has been confirmed on Mars. It's been found in the deeper craters on the uh, Martian Plateau, and there's water on Mars, people. There's no water on Mars. There was once water on Mars. Water has been confirmed to have once existed on Mars. In the deeper craters and plateaus of the Martian atmosphere, water has been discovered in its thickened uh, hydrostatic uh, formula... No. Don't add too many goddamn details if you know nothing about this story. <laughs> They're looking at rocks. It's a bear. I mean, what is he going to have to say anyways? <laughs> right? Like it was something to say? What do you mean, what kind of bear? What kind of bear? What kind of bear? I don't know. It could be any kind of bear. I don't know. Maybe it's a really personable bear. She's our temporary sports broadcaster. We don't think she's gonna stick. Oh, let's watch. The ducks got spanked so hard, and I think they liked it. Watching them throw the ball halfway across the field was just so exciting. I love football. I don't think we can show that on the air. That was, um... Does that woman actually work for the network? I've never seen her before. I certainly can't forget her now, though. Good news. <laughs> Uh, I don't think you should be filming Hello. the delivery guy. Thanks, man. No problem. Thank you very much. All right. All right. You want a coffee? Uh, no, I'm all set. And now, a roller coaster that will actually kill you. The roller coaster was designed to take the rider up a 500 meter climb to a dizzying height. Apparently, what will happen is that riding on the roller coaster will actually cause your organs to fail. Is that correct? No, have you seen the picture of the fucking thing? Certainly not. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> no. The idea behind the coaster is that the G-forces actually separate your heart and lungs, causing a euphoric state as your body is dashed to pieces. And if the first drop doesn't take you out, the next six loops probably will. That sounds horrible. Why do they call it the Euphoria Coaster? They don't call it that. That's completely in your head. It's called the Euthanasia Coaster. Oh, that makes a lot more sense. Euphoria is a state of bliss. Euthanasia is a state of death. Cutting to weather. Okay, cut to weather. Um, did anybody actually hire a weather person? It appears not. Ah, hey, you, sound guy. Uh, what's the weather in Southern Oregon like today? It's uh, kind of drizzly. Rainy in Southern Oregon. Well, it's always raining somewhere in Oregon. It's a pretty good bet. It certainly is. Oh, that was fun. Uh, water down dwarves. An epileptic. That's not what it says. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's pretty close to what it says. I'm pretty sure you need glasses. I don't need glasses. I have eyes like an eagle. An eagle that needs glasses. Are you awake and incredibly high? Well, me too. Tune in to RVTV's new amazing broadcast, Southern Oregon News Network. I believe that's federally illegal. <laughs> we won't use this one, <laughs> that's, You can't advocate the use of okay. illegal substances. <clears throat> Are you staying up late? Maybe you're slightly out of your mind. Well, now is the time to tune in to RVTV's new amazing broadcast, the Southern Oregon News Network, the newsiest news on the net. So you're just gonna say it all? I'm gonna take it, all of the words for me. No words for you, all for me. Southern Oregon News Network, tune in. This guy's there, I'm there, I'm talking a lot. I got all the spot. Ah, ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Southern Oregon. But here's something even crazier. It's called cover blubber. And for people that get tired of using all of that disposable cellophane wrap, the cover blubber actually goes over your item like a gelatinous holding prison to protect and preserve your food. It's reusable, it's mostly non-toxic, and it's going to revolutionize your kitchen. Cover blubber. How about that? I think that's a terrible invention. The next is a, um, a huge clip with a foam grip. I'm pretty sure that's just a carabiner. That's not an invention at all. Why is that next? even on our list? A huge cross that clip shit with a foam grip. <laughs> Good night. Thanks for tuning in. 
This has been an excellent time for us to practice all the things that we've done wrong. Thank you for tuning in to the first Southern Oregon News Network broadcast. It's been a real pleasure. A. Scott McLassen. McG. A. Scott McG. A. Scott whose name will not be known. And that's the news. Hope you learned something. I didn't. Next time on the Southern Oregon News Network. Scott it's gonna be a beautiful day, son. Shit. Hi, Big Boss. Damn, girl. That's what I'm talking about. Come over here, let me talk to you a little bit. I'm Donna Cleveland, and this has been the Nympho News. Aren't you? I feel the same way. When I was your age, I took up the drink. That made me strong. And that's the news, son.